All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. And, well, we got the chef's key, so I figured we will head to the kitchen. That is a big blunder. <laughs> oh, never know what might happen. All right, so we, um... Okay. Interesting. Yes. Um, yeah. That's kind of gross, but that might come in handy. So we have an ice pick. All right. So, and I figure, um, so another piggy. Okay. Um, okay. So what is in here? Freezer. Salmon. Okay. Yeah, we know that. Well, yeah, we'll let, wait, we have an ice pick. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Hang on. There we go. Ice pick. Yeah, sorry, it had been a little while since, uh, no, since I played. Ice pick. Use. There we go. Yes, it's been a little since we played this. All right, so we were able to use the ice pick to get the ice. Great. Um, do you do anything? What's up, Piggy? I know you're just a pig, but I want to tell you this. <laughs> um. All right, sweet. So we have ice. So I'm assuming that we are going to use that ice in order to... Wait. So... Yeah. Okay, I gotcha. So we use the bowl on the ice. There we go. So now we have a storage container for some brains. Yay! That's not something I really particularly want to say. Oh, just because I like doing things. Okay. Uh, so we gotta head back and gather some brains now that we have a place to put them. Okay. Okay. Come on, buddy. Apparently, I have to be going for a walk. <laughs> in this view, in order to take the brain. Okay. I don't know. So I, I, I can't. I don't know if I can take anything off the shelves yet. But whatever. All right. Let's head back up and see, Doctor A. All right, creepy doctor man, I have your brains. Ah, I see you have it. Quick, give it to me. Give it to me, boy. You don't need to be snippy. Give brain. Is this what you wanted? One fresh human brain. What else could I want? That's, that's a good yes. question. Now we have a chance. Eradicate the bad. Restore the good. Or what's left of it, anyway. All right. Yeah, whatever. Fingers crossed. Telling him isn't... This has nothing to do with luck, <laughs> mind you. I am certain Try my calculations were correct. Now it's just a matter of following a correct procedure. But since my nurses took their leave all at once, I will require your assistance. Oh, great. This cavity here... Hold yes. it open for me whilst I lower the brain into place. Put some elbow grease into it, boy. <laughs> That's better. Okay. And a little push. Hmm, maybe this way. It's okay, it's just the bowl. We can clean it up later. <laughs> I, Almost. I, I don't know what to say right now. Just a tiny bit more. 
It's in! We've done it, boy! And that accomplished... Uh... I'm yeah. beginning to wish I'd never met you. You would have missed the only chance to save yourself and everyone else. Sure, this isn't the nicest job, but it's a job nevertheless, and it's got to be done. What okay. job Look, is this exactly? We'll talk about it later. Let's focus on our task. Which is? Now that everything is ready, it is time for the machine. The machine? Yes, we will need to kick some life into this young lady. She's still very much Alrighty dead. Have you then. forgotten? She's only mostly dead. Uh, let's I haven't forgotten. See what happens. Good, because we have no more brains to spare, boy. I'll let you do the honors. I'm a man. There's a lever on the side of that chair over there. Can you see it? Just walk over to the right. I've run the wires from the chair to the body on the table. Less heavy lifting. See? Safer for our spines. Ooh. That's cool now. Okay. What about it? What does it do? Pull it and we shall see. All right. I it makes the room go to a red hue. Cast a lightning bolt spell. And then... I don't understand. And then... Have we run out of power? Uh... Hmm, it's probably just a fuse. I'd better go and investigate it myself. You're not going to make me do it, really? <laughs> and what am I supposed to do? I'm uh, not sitting in the chair. Alright, we can't examine the body any further. Hello? What? Where? What is... Hello? No. No way. Stop. Whoever you are... Don't come any closer. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. Thank you, and I'm so very glad that you said that, but... <laughs> but that's not the only problem here. I woke up, I'm butt naked, and I'm really freaking cold. I need some clothes, man. Huh? I'm not coming out until you get me something to wear. And... yeah, there's a whole... Bring me some clothes! Okay! I'm gonna sit here all day. I guess we're going to go find some clothes. Alright, so I don't really know where to get clothes at. So we're going to go to the third floor and see what we find. Creepy noises. Creepy paintings. <sighs> yeah. Interesting. Oh, that's not good. What? Oh, these girls don't have any clothes either. That's a bummer. So we can probably put some poison in there. Okay. <laughs> and if we could loosen up the fingers, okay. What? Yeah, that's the thing I'm concerned about this bathroom. Is the stove. Nothing happens. The 
gas supply has probably been turned off. All right, so we, Sophie. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Where's my wife? You will never find her. Well, you're not very pleasant. She is mine. Mine. Uh, we'll see about that. <laughs> oh, well, I mean, I'm supposed to kill the other one first. I don't know. I'm apparently supposed to, I don't know, if I need to do that to progress the story. I mean, I still need some clothes. Read notice. Okay, so do I want to check out the fourth floor too? I guess we can. We got the syringe, we can get some poison. I turn on the gas. All right. Fourth floor is out of commission for the moment. Fair enough. But I still need clothes. I don't know. Let's go down. Like I said, I don't particularly want to do this, but I'm, I'm worried that to progress the story, I'm gonna have to get some poison, use the syringe, whatever. So, oh yeah, let's turn on the gas supply. I've switched it on. Okay. Uh, let's, oops, I'm sure one of these would give somebody a peaceful death, but which one? Oh, I, I think the red one says morphine, so we'll do that. Here goes nothing. It's time for your medicine, girl. Oh, that's creepy. I don't like that. The music has definitely taken an interesting turn. Are we going dubstep? I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm not a, an expert in... It's kind of cool. I don't want to do this, but I think I kind of have... Oh. <sighs> yeah, I really don't like this, but... Oh. This syringe? Is this what you wanted? It seems so. <sighs> Will it hurt? I don't know. I hope not. I don't really know. I hope not. You don't know? Well, you Are you sure it's... Are you even sure it's gonna kill me? You... <sighs> there was poison written... You don't want to make me do this? I don't want to do it! And a picture of a skull. Okay. That sounds about right, I guess. But She's gonna have some... I'm gonna ask you one last favor. Can you do it? What? Take that needle and stick it in my arm. I don't. I can't do it myself. No. Please. I'm begging you. 
I mean, the game is obviously going to make me do this. I'm not happy about it, but... I'm already doomed anyway. Give me your arm. Ew. That's... I don't think that's how poison works. Ugh, this... this game! I don't... Well, we got some clothes! Oh gosh, I... I guess we'll take them. Oh... I... I am without words at the moment. I... Uh, I don't know if there's a way to play through the game without doing that. I mean, maybe after I finish it... I'll try to look it up. I don't really want to spoil anything for me. I'm, I mean, this, this game is interesting and upsetting and whatever, so... I don't know. I have no words at the moment. But let's go give Frankenstein's monster girl thing some clues. Alright. So has she figured out that she's not in her body yet? Bring me some clothes. I don't want to sit here all day. Yeah, I keep forgetting that game makes me, like, wear... Put this on. Is she going to be like the fourth iteration? What? What in the... Really? A wedding dress? Am I like rebuilding my wife? We have the technology. I'm sorry. All the shops were closed. What? So you just pulled this thing out of garbage? Wow, this is so neat. How did you know? I can tell already that you and me are going to be the best of friends. What? <laughs> I'll gladly take it back if it's not good enough for you. You can go looking for your own dress. And good luck with that. You can go looking for your own dress. Look at him all smug and condescending. You can see damn well I have no great choice here. I wear a chicken costume if you brought one. Then what are you moaning for? <laughs> Who's moaning? You're moaning. But... Okay, whatever. Uh, I, it. Go over there for a second and I'll put this thing on. Because, you know, you've been staring at me naked, but now that I'm going to get dressed. Yeah, there's blood on it. Well, yeah. With me. Did you butcher somebody's wife-to-be to get this dress? <laughs> I don't think no, so. Of course not. Why do I not believe you? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. How do I look? That is a creepy smile. I mean, it looks nice, but... <sighs> I kind of want to pick that choice. I don't know. I, I just, I'm just gonna say this. You, yeah, you look good. I do. Mm, yeah, sure. Thank you. Okay. So. Yeah. So what? Good, I, but not great. Actually, you know I, what? You you do look great. Yep, totally great. You're Very like nice. Very pretty. Lovely posture. A Joker model from Tim Very Burton Batman. Long, and black. Oh, stop it. I meant the dress. Huh? I know damn well my eyes are green and my hair is black. What I want to know is this. 
How do I look in this dress? Okay, this is... Oh my Great. gosh. I'm warning you. <laughs> oh, it seemed nothing like a Galway girl. Um... Oh, let's just Beautiful. say this. Oh. Thanks. I kind of do, don't I? <laughs> I never pictured myself wearing a freaking wedding dress, but hey, I guess this could totally be my new thing. Okay, so she's in a different body. It's not really my color, and it's a bit tight around the waist. I, but I just I don't know anymore. To be when you wake up covered in blood in a strange room with no recollection of who you are. Oh. That, okay. That is Do you interesting. remember your name? Why? Do you not know it? I figured we were friends. But now that you've asked, you could be anyone, really. A deranged psychopath, for all I know. Wait. Yeah. Maybe I do know your name. Let me think. Is it Francisco? Um, I'm a fan of the Golden Girls. We're gonna go Dorothy. I'm pretty sure your name was Dorothy. Wow, it's incredible. So, I was right. No. But it's incredible that you just said a totally random name hoping to be right. <laughs> I mean, what are the chances? I have a lot going on. You can tell me now. <sighs> it's Agnes. Doesn't sound like Dorothy. Not even a bit. Okay. It's nice to meet you. Okay. Um, what are yeah. You going to do? I, I think I'm going to tag along. The story All right. The cool. There are worse out there. Yeah, True. I was afraid you'd say that. But you won't let anything happen to me, right? Uh, yeah, I, I'm not promising anything. I'll try. But I can't promise anything. Yep. Sure thing. Taking care of damsels in distress isn't really your thing, is it? There's a guy with a goddamn axe out there. Well, right. I mean, that guy's me. I'll try not to bleed all over you when he chops me to pieces. I appreciate that. My name is Joe Davis, by the way. Oh, so you are Joe Davis. And, okay. Of course, now it all makes sense. It does? It does. Go on. I'm supposed to give you a message. A note. There was your name on it. Okay. And when I first saw it, I thought, Joe Davis? Who the fuck is Joe Davis? And it's you. A letter? There we go. Where did you find it? I held it all scrunched up inside my hand when I came alive. No clothes, none of my stuff. That was the only thing I had on me. So I figured it must be important. Already then. You still got it? No, I ate it. <laughs> of course I've still got it. But awesome. since this dress doesn't have any pockets, I hid it in here. Oh. Okay. Can you turn around for a moment? I'll get it out. The note. I'll get the note out. <laughs> well, is that okay? Too close. Just walk further away and give me a minute, okay? Alrighty then. Oh! Run! Where? I don't know where she's gonna run to. Hey, all right, stop. Or I die. I was gonna try to fight him, but I failed. Game over? What? I. What is... I didn't know that was going to happen. Okay. 
so what what in the world apparently we have multiple characters there's a moose head let's talk to it all right so yeah apparently there are multiple storylines interwoven as well so i guess we will discover more as we go um thanks for watching and we'll see you soon